look at the Muhlenberg men's basketball roster for the 2014-15 season, and one thing jumps out. Of the 15 players, eight are freshmen and only three are upperclassmen. We're definitely a really young team this year. Um, the guys that we have are, are really good freshmen, actually. Um, and it's really not that they're behind. We, we started a new offense, um, changed up our defense, so we're all basically on page one. We're still raw, we're still learning, but we'll get there. The new style of play, which will debut at the Centennial MAC Challenge this weekend, is designed to take advantage of the Mules' youth and athleticism. We're uh, trying to play a little more faster than we have in the past. We have a, a lot of good athletes, a lot of young a lot of young legs and fast kids that are athletic, so we're just trying to get after it a lot more on defense, get in passing lanes, and you know, speed up the game a little bit and put, put pressure on the other opposing team on, when we're on defense and they're on offense and you know, put them on their heels and try to, get, try to get some easy baskets off that. So I think it's going to be a faster, you know, more aggressive, fun style of basketball. This will be a really, really, really exciting team. Um, I think we'll be more balanced this, this year than we've been in years past. Um, we're playing a lot of up-tempo basketball, a fun up-tempo game for everybody. Killing, the lone senior, has been playing up-tempo ever since arriving at Muhlenberg and has led the Centennial Conference in scoring for the last two years. Junior Alex Stavetsky, an all-conference pick last year, brings considerable experience and shooting ability while Miloski is coming back from an injury that cut short his sophomore season. The other returning varsity players are sophomores, guard John Schreer, swingman Brandon LaRose, and big man John Hunter. Mixing in all the new faces on and off the court have been high priorities in the preseason. The team chemistry this year, I think it's very good. I think we're all, we're all a cohesive unit more than it has been in the past, and I think we've all just been making it a priority to be together as a team as much as possible and spend as much time together as possible. And you know, that, that's what's gonna win, win games for us in the long run. Muhlenberg has won its share of games over the years and made the CC playoffs the last three seasons, but the big one at the end has proved to be elusive. If everything comes together, that could change this year. For us, with the talent level that we have, it's, it's pretty much championship or bust for us. Um, we've had those expectations you know, since my freshman year, and I mean, there's no need to change them now. We've definitely got the group of guys to do it. Um, we might have a slow start just with youth, but I promise towards the end of the season um, we'll get clicking and, and everything will be good for us.